In this video, you will learn about firewall and virtual network in Azure SQL database. So without further ado, let's get started. I am on Azure portal and you see I have a SQL server and a database. I'll click on SQL server and then here in firewall virtual networks, you see here option to add client IP. Azure SQL server has additional security layer to protect from malicious access to your database. So I need to add my client IP that is my current IP address so that I can access this database from my SQL Server Management Studio. So I already added my IP address here in case you would like to add all IP then you just type here any rule name and then start IP 0.0.0.0 and end IP 255.255.255.255 and then hit on save. After that it will allow every access that is every IP to access your SQL server. Now there is another option which helps a lot. Let's assume you have a virtual machine and you hosting your web application show over there. Now, in order to access this database by your web application and to get the best experience, you need to add that existing virtual network here. So if you click on add existing virtual network and name it here, select the subscription and you will be able to see virtual network in this list and then select name and address prefix here and then hit on OK. Now this SQL server and its databases will be available in the same virtual networks which has all your virtual machines and all your services. Hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching.